So I'm totally filming this video while I'm talking to you while I'm sitting on the toilet in my bathroom. You join the natural team. I'm seeing bones broke apart. You're cutting things off your body that were so close to my heart. Before you start getting tapers, asking my barbers and dress, can we just slow it down and press free? So I wanted to make this video because I'm sure like most people, they are always busy and they have a lot of things to do when they're not always home. I mean, it's going to be an extremely rare situation where you would find me at my house for an extended period of time. Um, when I put my perm rods in, I try to make them sit at least, at least 12 hours so I can get a good curl because it takes forever for my hair to dry. And on top of that, my hair is just weirder than most people's hair. It just, it takes a lot more effort to get these curls in and to keep these curls in. So I wait at least 12 hours and most times I don't have 12 hours to sit around in the house. So I usually put the perm rods in once a week, every Friday night. But I have a ton of things to do early Saturday mornings and the easiest way for me to go along my days and not just be walking out in public looking all crazy, I decided to come up with a plan and putting on like a head wrap. Everyone loves head wraps. Head wraps help. <laughs> Hashtag head wraps help. That's the reason I ran out and bought a head wrap and this is what I'm gonna start using on Saturday mornings if it hasn't exceeded that 12 hour mark and these things are still sitting in my head. So hopefully this could help you out. Um, there are lots of different ways to tie a head wrap. I am a newbie, but this is my go-to one for the moment. 